Hi everyone, the Lone Wolf here, and welcome back to Diablo 3 Season 6. And uh, you may have seen from the previous video that I got a yellow crossbow. I also activated my wings and my pets, so it's time to try and uh, get things into higher gear. What I actually think I want to try is to see if I can maybe level up on hard, now that I have a yellow weapon. Uh, so maybe it's going to uh, be almost impossible, but maybe it'll just speed me up a little bit. So that's what we're going to try for this video. Uh, we're going to try and... Um, and I'm still in adventure mode, yep. So we're going to try to do some bounties on hard um, at level 9. And see if uh, I can speed things up even more. Because, well, honestly, uh, the first video did go along very nicely. So here we go, um, I'm just going to go along the natural order, so I, I did the first part in Act uh, 1, so I'm going to do the next part in Act 2, where we've got uh, Lost Treasures, we've got the Desolate Sands, Clear the Vile Cavern, uh, Prisoners the Cult, and we've got Kill Magda, that's not easy, and Zoltan Cool as well, alright, that's pretty, pretty uh, interesting. We will start, I think... This one is first on the list. So here we go and free the Chaldean villagers from the iron cages. Uh, my guess is that I'll have to just keep going upwards. Worked out last time. So here we go on hard. A little bit of rapid fire to open up. Seems to work. That's pretty good. And this is indeed where I have to be. So let's get going. I think the best way is to try and uh, do these bounties as efficiently as possible. So let's uh, fire this off a little bit. Take that. Rapid fire. And now I can also use this yeah, to move myself in the right direction. Okay. So get a, a treasure coming up here. Iron cage. Let's open this up. First one done. Okay. A little bit of rapid fire next. They are wounded, so that should be good. Let's see if we can uh, attract everyone here. Maybe use this as well. Get my rage up. Start rapid firing. Yeah, that is pretty handy. Couple more shots. Need more hatred. Need more hatred. So my first impression trying to do this on hard is that it's well not as easy as on normal. Um, but we'll have to see what the XP tells me, of course. Those just got killed. You guys are next. Let's open this up. Who knows? More. More rapid fire. That kills him. And I can actually go through all of that, that's pretty handy. Build up some more rage. Rapid fire those guys, get a massacre going. Oh, that's true, I'd forgotten that massacre is pretty damn handy to get XP boosts. So we'll kill you, grab the iron cage, and now I need to find two more. And if I want to speed up the movement a little bit, we can always go like that. Now there we have to go. Which is going to be... That's right. <laughs> that rapid fire, honestly, it is pretty damn cool. Uh, those guys are pretty annoying, so let's try to take care of them a little bit. The rapid fire in their general direction. Go like that. Get out of all of this if I can. 
That's decent. The rage is up. Die here, guys. Good. Anyone else left protecting this? And we reach level 10. Awesome. We can open up this cave, obviously. Let's see what we get. A passive. This does. Whenever you use Vault. X-ray vision. Our enemies hit by our hatred. Spenders are slowed by... Alright, we'll, we'll probably take that. Although it only helps rapid fire at the moment. And let's try to find the final villager to free. Off we go. More. Everyone together. That's done. Ah, god damn it. Still had to attract them, of course. Enough with you. Down you go. And that's the first bounty done. Good. So, let's go to the next one. Um, yeah. Decently tricky. Still, we did get a whole level from uh, a single bounty. Enter the tomb of the cap and claim the treasure. All right, let's see if we can do that. What's up here? Let's see how he likes these. Oh my god, it just reflected my attacks. That was pretty cool. And we get a waypoint. Awesome. More. Birds will land. Fallen Conjurer, he's down. Pretty big group here. Rapid fire. And then they are slowed. Yeah, that is pretty cool. Enough of that. And... Kill. A chest. That would, could be good. Seems suspicious. Get out of here. Build up the reach. Holy crap. Keep moving. <laughs> Interesting. Yeah, gotta use the heals. And he has a pretty annoying ability as well. With that uh, electric stuff. But I think we can handle him now. I hope so. Yes. Good. And that's not really too great. But it worked out. And as you can see, that does give me a good chunk of XP. A uh, couple of blues next. Alright, let's use rapid fire now that we still can. Now we can't, so then we retreat while using this. More rapid fire. Take that one down. Die there, please. Go up here. Don't stay in all of that plate stuff too long. One down. Low quality leather cuffs. Right. Going down, guys. Escape. That's enough. <laughs> that, honestly, that is pretty damn cool. How you reflect that. You're going down as well. Dagorn just came online. And, all oh, right, I thought it was maybe something like a pattern, but it isn't. That gives me extra toughness. Honestly, we'll just keep the yellow one. And keep heading out here. Try to focus on the bounties just a little bit. Slow everyone down. Pepper them. Some of these arrows. I keep going. Next level, what do I get here? 
Well, we get attacked to start out with. Die, guys. You as well. Thank you. Alright, what do we get here? Um, shoot out an explosive bola that wraps itself around him. After one second, the bola explodes 460% weapon damage. Doesn't seem to be that good. But also, alright, we'll give it a try at least, I think. And then instead of, we can withering fire, reduce the initial hatred cost. And fire damage. Alright, that's that's good. That's a lovely upgrade. Uh, we actually have quite a long way to go. Let's see how... Can I use that? Oh, that's this one. That's actually a pretty cool attack as well. And that gives me rage. Okay. Uh... I'm alright with this combo so here. It's pretty interesting. Let's take some fire damage. And since they are together, let's try to tag them all with this stuff. And that gives me something to do. I'm alright with this combo. Although it doesn't do like really direct damage. It's alright, it's alright. Rapid fire, down we go. Let's see if we can. Uh, oh man. Even a lot of more, a lot more stuff here. Let's keep firing these off. As we finally find our waypoints. Rapid fire, a few more of these. Loading bolas. Die. Let's go over here. Keep adding them. I wonder if it stacks. That's not entirely clear to me. Or if you have to put them on different different ones. Let's see. No, oh, that does seem to, to stack and keep exploding. Okay, pretty cool. Uh, we can also see a blue up there. Let's keep firing off the bolas here. And where the hell do I enter? Should be a way over here. Alright, here they are. Let's uh, get some of this going. Mm, electric again. Let's vault, heal. Use these. Yeah, I'm not even sure which, which is actually better here. This is pretty cool. Um... Oh man, my rage stays up so high. Actually, just keep firing like this. Just a couple more. Stop that, you. And we get something yellow. All right. Uh, pants. First pants. Thank you. Let's see how that explodes. All right. Open up the chests. Finally, definitely not uh, fast progression here. Is this gonna open up or what? Oh, now we get a yellow here. Interesting. If I can disappear, maybe vault away. Oh my god, electrified powerful minion. Uh, that's pretty annoying. Let's vault through this again. Use a bit more of this. Rapid fire. 
Get the healing. Keep hitting them. Die, you bastards. Electrified is not a good match for uh, for this attack, for sure. But alright, I did get another level out of this. I'll take these cuffs and I will open this up. But man, yeah, Act 2 bounties... This is uh, this is taking quite a bit more time. Could also be because I'm doing this on hard. All right, blue one first here. Interesting. Let's get rid of these two if I can. Good. More bolas. Escape. More bolas. Show up here. More of this. Get out. Again. Rapid fire. Electrified again. God damn it. The game does want me to die here. Get out. You use a quick heal, I think. These guys just disappeared on me. Okay, get more. Some explosions, please. Get through them. He's left. Oh my god, this is. <laughs> this is decently tricky. Look at that. Needing to heal again. Enough of that. Finally down. Finally, some extra damage. It is a two-handed bow, but that should definitely help this, this Bola shot to do some more AoE damage. And now claim the treasure. Alright, let's see if we can do that. Again with the Electrified, again with the blues here. Let's keep using some Bolas. He just dropped a crossbow, but not a better one. Bastards. Get through them. No, nope, this is not the way to go. Oh, and I can use this as long as... I oh, right, that's interesting. So, first time I actually noticed the discipline now on the use of Vault, because I can move a bit faster with that. Die. Here we go again. Spam these first. Molten minion. Yeah, molten is pretty annoying as well. Keep firing. <laughs> oh my god. That's a couple down finally. see how he likes my rapid fire which doesn't cost too much rage anymore there we go and that blows up all right i'll take that thank you let's keep looking empowered shrine going what's up here sure. some invisible guys and some AOE right. watching the explosions around you like that is pretty satisfying look at that But another dead end. God damn it. Get back. Olympian. Achievement unlocked. Good. I need more discipline. Understood. 
And it comes back pretty quickly. Last will. My life has been long. I have gathered this much wealth yet. around me, but... Oh my god. Brought me nothing but pain. Thanks for the extra damage. So I'll have to open this up as well. On my family. This room shall hold my treasure for all eternity. None shall divine its secrets. Well, I'll have to give the try if, if I want my bounty. So in we go. Oh, and that's it. Couple small guys. Rapid fire, get out. More rapid fire. Just don't stay in there. And finally, that is done. Nothing that's really a lot better. But we got a bounty done. One and two. So next, clear the vile cavern. Let's go do that. At least I'm leveling up decently quickly. Down we go. Oh, let's see if uh, we can get some stuff done on him. I would. Love the loot, come on. Heal. Just died, that's good. I get another level. Couple bola shots. On them. And yeah, what the hell, let's just get in here. We actually want to focus at least somewhat on the bounties. And that's good. Keep going. Uh, clear all enemies at stage 2. So we're gonna head over there. Honestly, I guess I can try to skip a little bit of this, but... Uh, I also mustn't overdo it, because it's not that easy for me at the moment. Up here... Yep, challenge, meet the wrong blue, you'll be in trouble. Like that. Holy crap. Alright, let's uh, quickly use this as well. More of these. Try to stay out of all the ice. Slow, stop that, you. More of these and he is down first ring plus damage that's pretty good more blues oh my god yeah act 2 is not treating me uh, too well when it comes to speed electrified again as well more firing Queen Bola shots get a bit of healing done here you're down, you're down. Good. What is this? Shoulders, extra vitality. I'll take him. Stop that. Venture. And here we go. The entrance to level 2. Let's get in on that. Oh yeah, I have to clear everything, so we'll start out with uh, going to the top, and I will try to go around. So we'll be going down, these will explode. And just keep following uh, the right side wall here. These. More firing. Oh, bloody hell. Trying to trick me again. 
frozen. Heal up. Alright, definitely get out of that. Heal up a little bit, a couple more Vola shots, and now we can just finish this guy off. We need to kill 15 remaining enemies, and these guys actually count. Alright, off we go. Who is next? Seven more. Line them up. Put them down. Next level. That's a lovely chest. Uh, we will quickly do this. A cursed chest could be pretty useful. Uh, or is this better? Yeah, definitely not fast enough. Quick check here. That's better. That's way better. And I'll focus on damage at this point, honestly. So there we go. What does this unlock? A fan of knives. Okay, we can try that for sure. Evasive fire shoots, spread bolt that hits the primary enemy, 200% damage and two additional enemies. Uh, okay, or we could use volatile, increases the explosion radius. We, we could try this evasive fire, then chakram. Honestly, rapid fire has been serving me really well. So I'm just going to accept this and then caltraps. Nope, definitely don't want that displacement. We'll take this, thank you. And then here we have preparation instantly, restore 30 discipline. Uh, no, I'll take the fault, thank you very much. Um, maybe one more thing. Your maximum hatred is increased by 25. You gain 30 hatred and 3 discipline when you are healed from a health globe. Uh, we'll, we'll, we'll stick with the slow here for now. So there we go, that's the third bounty done. Now we have to kill Zoltan Cool and Magda. Uh, let's see if Zoltan Cool takes a long time because we have been busy for another half hour. Um, but uh, how much do I have to work in order to get to him? That's the question. Can I just click on this? Yep, kill Zoltan Cool. All right. Oh, so let's go. And those are my evasive shots. Oh, that's pretty good for Zolt and Cool, honestly. Let's vault out of that. Keep firing these. Let's get out of here and again. I do take quite a bit of damage, but. Uh, fun of nice. That looks like that. Alright. A few more of these. If I can reach that. Yes. More hatreds. Escape out of this. Just try not to take too many of those explosions. That's one guardian down. That's two guardians down. He drops some health globes. Just try not... <laughs> not to... <laughs> to stick around for all of these explosions. Grab Hatred this. Is Hatred is too low. Alright, we'll go like this. And I'm slowed, but we can get out of that. That's good. Hatred is back. That should help me. Get out of that. Couple more shots. A bit more hatred. Come on. Down it goes. So that worked out. Um, that's... Thank you very much. Well, yeah, yeah, I'll keep it. Uh, I'll take that then. That's it for the better stuff. And so now the final one, kill Magda, and then we'll have done all of these for Act 2. Uh, so okay, good good idea for me to stick around, because the Zoltan Cool one was pretty easy. And with some reluctance that I write on the seven lords of hell, for they are the oh, I also have to kill 50 enemies, gotcha. They are divided okay. into the lesser evils, Belial, Asmodan, Juriel, and Mandaril, and the prime evils, Mephisto, Baal, and Diablo. Oh my god, that's... Yeah, I like this, this evasive shot. Way better than the Bola shots, to be honest. It adds a little bit of mobility. You, you have to 
get to know it without a doubt, uh, but I'm liking what it does here. Blue and yellow, alright. Let's see if I can retreat a little bit using this. Get out of that prison. Yeah, just keep just keep going. It's pretty good. If you are in trouble, you can always vault out. Holy crap. Yeah. Yeah, a little bit more tricky. Get out. Some rapid fire on these guys next. Good. Vault to the healing. Stay out of this. Rapid fire on this guy. And we reach level 15. Okay. Uh, who is left here? A couple of these. Bit of rapid fire. Stop that, you. More? God damn it. Okay. Honestly? That is a cool ability. Uh, grenade, stroke grenades that bounce and explode. I, I, I feel like I want to stick with evasive fire. Seems pretty damn good. Uh, we get a new rune for Ebale, which is nothing that I need to worry about right now. I need to kill a couple more. We can just rapid fire these guys, then to retreat using this. My hatred is back. Rapid fire here again. Uh, let's use a fan of knives as well. These are pretty tough. And electrified, yeah. Bit more. Down you go. And I can heal. Okay, time to go look for Magda, I think. Stop that, you. These guys. Gonna be up here without a doubt. Stop that, you. Return to Tyrael? That's strange. Oh, all I have to do is kill 50. What the hell? Alright, another, another boss mob, so we'll obviously go after that one. Just the added mobility from this, and the fact that it's 200%, that's definitely not too bad. I like it. I can escape from you pretty easily. Okay, Demon Hunter. Pretty cool. Fun. Uh, really nicely mobile. Definitely does what uh, you would expect from character. And I actually think I do want to still go for Magda here. Just want to be sure that uh, I don't miss out on anything. Doesn't she have an entrance up here somewhere? Yeah, let's see if we can if we can handle it, honestly. It should be interesting. So there is Magda, the lair of the witch. A bit more. Keep attacking. Well, if you're gonna keep just sitting there. Alright, that's a little bit more dangerous. Yeah, let's see if we can escape over here. Fall back while doing damage. Use Phantom Knives. Get out of this. Heal up. Let's go. Quite a few adds here. Use some rapid fire. Use this again as well. Fire on Magda. Get out. Some retreating shots. Try to stay out of that. Here we go. Rapid fire. Everybody dies. <laughs> we'll take that. Thank you. I can heal up. Yeah, you can keep asking for more reinforcements, honestly. Hatred is too low. Alright, let's retreat again. Second wave of ads. Uh, gonna lose a fan of knives on this one. Alright, these guys are actually molten. 
adding to the cha challenge, but giving me pretty good XP as well. Like it. Get behind Magda, focus on her a little bit. I do like my rapid fire here, guys. Take that, heal is up. Now she's actually starting to use her spells as well. Luckily, I've got the mobility. So I can take care of all of these guys. Firing. I don't think I want to take all of these spells. But like that. Gets the job done. And gets me to level 16. So okay, let's head back here to the mercenary camp. That's an um, interesting experience. Not too easy, but as you can see, still very doable. And we just reached uh, level 16 in like one hour playtime. So let's also... Uh, that's obviously a lot better. I'll take that. Thank you very much. So is this... The rest we're gonna sell. Or maybe we're gonna just take uh, uh, salvage these. Because we will probably be able to use those resources for these plants. That does make sense. See if I can use them here. That's definitely not better either. And more of that. So here we go, guys. Yep. Pretty cool stuff in my book. Um, not sure why he keeps giving me quests, but we'll check that out later. Anyways, that's uh, another look at Diablo 3 Season 6. Definitely made quite a bit of progress in not too much time. So thank you very much to all the viewers that told me to get started right away in Adventure Mode. That's going to speed things up by quite a little bit. Uh, and this way it's also decently fun and decently challenging. So thank you very much for watching and I'll see you all next time.